we actually had a, a faculty member stuck out of town on vacation so he emailed me in a panic I can't make it for class the first week of classes I need to record what do you recommend and I was able to record uh, video lectures uh, go over syllabi recording my voice I uh, even wrote out some notes, scanned them in, and then went over the notes. He um, emailed me back, that was fantastic, thank you so much, this worked out great. Everybody needs this. We need to have all of our faculty using this. I'll usually say that it's a very lightweight desktop program, and it allows them to do desktop recording with audio, with very few buttons and settings to get in the way and confuse them. Once I started recording, after a few minutes, it was pretty natural, and I felt like I was just lecturing to an empty room, and the students actually received it very well. I got a lot of surprise by the, the amount of positive feedback. Even our tech phobe faculty were able to utilize this process and, and download the recorder to their computers and, and record their lectures, and they get done, and they're like, that's it? I'm done? And what we find is that if it's recorded and it's online, the students that get the problem, watch it, and go, okay, I got it. The ones who are having a problem with it, they stop, they rewind, they go back, they hear it again, so they go at their own speed. I think I spend more time using it to create videos for my job, you know, to train people on other things than I do maintaining or administering. So it's, a, it's something that, uh, it's a technology that's here, it's a technology that's gonna stay and uh, we just need to be able to adapt to it.